your car's remote doesn't work anymore to unlock your car, then stay tuned because today I'm going to show you how to fix a remote. Now if your remote doesn't work, the first thing to do is to get a screwdriver, take it apart and check the battery inside. The battery has just come out and you replace it with a new one. And you can get them lots of places, I just go to the local Walgreens and buy them. But if you put it back together and it still doesn't work even using a new battery, then it's time to try a new remote. So I just googled that and ended up at keyfobs.com and had one mailed to me. And it was only $16.99. A couple days later it came in the mail. And you want to make sure you're getting two things. The actual fob itself that opens the door and the directions of how to program it because they're all different. Because these babies need programming. If you push the button out of the box, it's not going to do anything. And these directions can be pretty crazy. Where do you see what you got to do on this Toyota? You think a madman invented this procedure? First, you have to make sure that all the doors are closed except the driver's door, which has to be open. Then you have to put the key in the ignition. Take the key out of the ignition, put the key in the ignition, and then take it out again. Then you have to close the driver's door, then open the driver's door, then close the driver's door, then open the driver's door, and put the key in the ignition, and then pull the key out of the ignition. Then the door locks will lock and unlock automatically by themselves to show you're in the programming mode. Then you press the lock and unlock buttons for one and a half seconds together. Then push the lock button and hold it down for two seconds. Then the door lock should lock and unlock themselves automatically, which shows you programmed it correctly. And now we'll check to see if it actually works. Success! It locks and unlocks. So the next time your remote stops working, why not fix it yourself? And remember, if you have any car questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel.